So I wanted to talk about uh, something real brief about um, just something that stood out to me that you know isn't like too too big of a big of a deal, um, but just something that like I kind of just wished would have still happened, which it still can because you know the the current arc, the chimera arc we're currently in, or that that I'm in is not over, um, but. I just wanted to briefly touch on uh, a couple of things. Um, it's, you know, it's specifically centered around uh, Leo here um, because it's it's more catered to to his character. Um, but you know, as a, as a whole, as far as the Chimera ants are concerned, it still pertains to them as well. Um, now, I know that you know ultimately the queen's job was to give birth to uh, Miriam to to the king, and you know, to also, um, you know, give birth to all these other minions that basically uh, served the king in helping him uh, gain rule over, you know, over the over the world. Um, but I, you know, I noticed that again. This is something that stood out to me. That, like I said, I kind of wish still would would continue. Is what I'm trying to say. Um, but I know that, you know, the ultimate goal as far as the current arc is concerned is focused on, you know, the king, Gon and Kahlua and whatever else may transpire moving forward in these episodes. But I like the fact that Leo, because they, you know, they, the writers decided to focus on his character a lot um, before, you know, around the time when the king was getting ready to arrive. Because he is half lion, half human, and we know, you know, as far as the rule is concerned, uh, as far as the, you know, the king of the jungle, that fits his character. Because he's a lion, you know, because he's supposed to be, you know, it's in his heart to be, you know, his own ruler, ruler of many, you know, have his own kingdom. That was his uh you know his place his stance his mindset um and pretty much still is uh you know because he's still out there somewhere doing something um but you know i i do love the fact that that he got a lot of screen time in this arc um which was very very cool to me um you know like i said it's, this isn't too much of a big of a deal um even though like i said i wish that there would be like something like something more like a filler where we got to see um, a few of the Chimera ants actually rule, maybe some side stories, maybe some stuff in like a manga, something like that um, to occur. But I just like the fact that Leo had a lot of screen time and they, you know, we got a chance to actually get to know where his mind was throughout all of this, because ultimately he wanted to you know basically to rule now i know i know zazan had ended up uh being one of the you know chimera ants who actually created her own nest um further in the show in episode you know roughly we got that information in episode 97 uh just before she ended up having her fight with uh fates and here from Fan phantom troll but i i do know that there are cert there are some chimera ants that were able to uh, move away from the flock after the king was born and you know just you know be able to uh, form their own nest and you know become you know kings and queens in their own you know in their own right because that's who they felt that they you know had the right to do for themselves so ultimately guys you know I just like I said guys I just love the fact that Leo got uh, some some key uh, screen time in this arc and you know we were we were also able to see you know what he could do because he when he showed up a few times uh before um he kind of you know faded off um in the background i was very intrigued with his character he just stood out to me and then you know when we got a chance to actually see how his men powers work that was just really really dope in his uh in his fight um against uh morel so i just um i just really really liked and was very intrigued with leo's 
position sorry guys I had a little technical difficulty there but like I was saying guys I just loved uh, Leo's character and his stance and his mindset of being the king because like I said specifically because they you know the writers decided to actually make him specifically a line and have you know Leo have the mindset of being his own king um, that just really was in my mind it was really really dope so um, but that's pretty much it on this video what did you all think of this this uh, discussion topic let's have a chat in the comment section guys um, let, let me know your thoughts and I will chat with you on the next Hunter x Hunter discussion video peace guys